We follow Claudia as she goes through her day-to-day -day routine, dealing with kind of the everyday stresses of, of, a, of a young person, a young adolescent, and also as she kind of copes with this, this added pressure, sadness of her parents' separation, and we watch her try to handle it. And one of the things that she does is she spends uh, every Monday night with her dad, and uh, on Tuesday mornings, before she goes to class, she goes down to the basement of the school and she hides certain objects, which are talisman in her life. And, uh, and it's that time alone in the basement where she kind of collects herself and gets to understand how she's really feeling about her parents' separation. And that's where we really get to know Claudia. Weird and mysterious, eh? Here's what happened. So this is what I found at my dad's apartment six months ago. These! So I go to my dad next time, like... <laughs> like, like, whose are they, right? And he goes, all fake normal. He goes, oh, those belong to Leslie. And I'm like, uh, who? He's like, oh, Leslie is a special friend of mine. Now, I don't want to sound precocious, but I know a euphemism when I hear one. And then, when I saw her, I knew from her boobs how special she was. They were like two flying saucers from another planet that came down and landed on her chest. And so she is able to be incredibly naive and innocent, but also really articulate and insightful about her circumstances.